Good evening, tie-dye family. I have a tapestry tied in the Mandela form. I have my mask on, so if you can barely hear me, that's why. This is Fire Red. I'm doing the bottom section in Fire Red and Power Berry. And then the top section is going to have the blues. This tapestry is dry. It, it was soaked in soda ash. I'm going to see if I can get better saturation by letting the product dry out before I start the hot water irrigation process. Alright, next I have the Power Berry. I am trying to get it down in between the folds so that the saturation is better than the last one. Next to the Power Berry, I'm going to add Sertraline Blue. I'm trying to be more cautious with my dye this time. I washed an awful lot down the drain on the last tapestry. Do want good saturation though. Hmm. I don't think I've quite learned the difference between the fine line of too much and not enough. Going from sertraline to better blue green.
from better blue green to turquoise. I'm sorry I sound weird. I did put a mask on today. I noticed that uh, messing with the powder dye yesterday bothered my breathing some. And I know I'm supposed to protect against that. So, if I sound weird, that's why I have the mask on the whole time I'm laying down dye this time. I want that in my lungs. <laughs> I don't want my nose not to be colored. My goodness. I know. Too much information. But that's what happens. And the last color I'm adding is Robin's Egg. I told you on the last one that I am doing what Stephanie from Fun Endeavors does and washing my plastic spoons so that I don't have to buy a particular spoon to put dye on with. Um, it's really easy to wash these off and just reuse them. Big sections. I'm trying really hard to get plenty on there and not dump it in the bottom. Fortunately, I'm doing a bit of both, unfortunately. All right, got the water heating. I'll be back in just a moment to start the irrigation process. First, I'm using my hand sprayer to dampen the dye so that it stays where I want it to when I begin the hot water irrigation. Learned this part from watching Raya's tie-dye. Next, I will be back with the big hot water irrigation. Have my large sprayer now filled with boiling hot water. Now I'm beginning to push the dye through. To the other side of the cloth. Notice that I'm pushing towards the outside.
that needs to soak in for a little while. I'll come and check the back in a little bit. If the back has color, then I'm finished with the hot water. If it doesn't, I'll put some more through there. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good evening.